Hey there, Heather Freeman here with Paint and Playground, and I've got out my sketchbook, and yesterday I got some new paint supplies, so I'm playing, playing today, and I thought I'd bring you along, show you I'm just playing with some layers in my little magazine sketchbook, and putting down some color this morning. I invite you in and we can hang out for a little bit this morning. So yesterday was super fun because I opened up a box of supplies and got some new things, some new colors and paint brushes, some things to play with. Uh, a little surprise I'm going to share with you in a future Facebook Live. Um, but I just put down some colors. I got my, let's see, magenta and a and a more of a purpley violet. Let me see if I can get you seeing my sketchbook a little bit more. Just laying down some first layers of color. Going right in with my fingers. I love using my fingers to paint and just smush around. Play. Let's see. Just gonna grab my paintbrushes. A little wet here. I've already laid down some white, just to cover up the image below, and then help this next layer stay on. Nancy saying hi, hi. Nancy Gray, I got two Nancys on. Actually here live, you made it Nancy. Awesome. Made it for a live. Add this deeper. This page is bubbling up a little bit, but that's okay, I'm just gonna be easy with it. This is my play journal. This is all about just having some fun. Let me know, do you have a little journal that you like to play with paint in? You know, it's super fun to be able to paint on big canvases. But the play can happen too in our little journals and that's where we get to experiment and discover things, discover ways of putting down color, making our mark. And that once we get to the bigger canvas, we've already played, we've got kind of have that more, more confidence to lay the paint down and put that mark down once we've already done it in the sketchbook. Oh, I need some more white. Do, 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 do. Am I white? Pink, just loving, loving the pinks right now. Let's see, getting the umber out. So yeah, I got a box of supplies yesterday and it was super fun to get that in the mail, to open it up and I didn't even remember what I had in there, or what I had ordered. So it was fun to rediscover what I was going to get to play with. Is that okay? Yeah. 
Nancy says, not yet, but because of you, I filled one smaller one and nearly a second one. Wow, awesome. Yeah, they're just, there's so much fun just to be able to be more free with your mark and play. Turquoise. Let that dry a little bit. Yeah, so kind of, you know, when I think about painting and getting that supply, you know, new, those new supplies, it just makes you feel like a kid again. And it's a treat to get supplies in the mail. That's really an important part of the creative process, is getting excited. So think about, you know, is it the color that gets you excited? I got some great new colors yesterday that I'm gonna experiment and play with and mix around and see what other colors I can come up with with those colors. Um, so is it the color that excites you? Is it, you know, the new tools that you get to play with? I got a couple of new paint brushes, uh, some paint pens. really important to connect with that and that's what's going to get you the canvas is getting excited and those things you know you might have forgotten what those things are that excite you now's the time to remember right is it the colors uh, is it the the tools that you're using um, maybe it's the surface that you're painting on let's see what do I want to do let's just start to make some marks See where this goes. Love that blue. Love it. Using your tools, I love just making marks with the tools that I have. Seeing what happens. There's just so many ways that we can use what we have and get excited about the new things that we're getting, right? Let's see. my pointed paintbrush go? Here it is. <clears throat> when you get excited about the color and the tools, that's where the joy is. That's where the fun happens. That's when we really can dive in and and play. That's what it's all about, is the play. Dots up there.
I'm just playing with the mark. Nancy, I love the blues. Never met one I didn't like. Can't say the same for any other color. And Nancy says, blue is my favorite color. Mm -hmm. There's so many different surfaces we can paint on. So not only color, if the color excites you, uh, maybe it's the tools that you're using, or maybe it's what you're painting on, right? There's so many different things that we can paint on. Uh, it can be a, you know, a magazine journal like you, we have here. It could be a sketchbook. It could be you know, large size paper. Uh, it could be a canvas. It could be wood. There's so many things that we can have fun painting on. So really thinking about you know, what is it that excites you? really important piece of helping get get helping to get you to the canvas Gonna keep working on this, see where it goes. See where it takes me. All right, so you all have a great day and I will see you next time at the canvas. All right, bye for now.